So this morning, Mr. Logan is working on the uh, John Deere 5065. What are you working on? Uh, I'm getting this Insight set up, the Ag Leader Insight. I uh, was a little confused. I had the wrong GPS on it, the new one, and that doesn't work with the older Insight. So now I'm going to put the 1500 on it. Got it. And that should get it going. Good. Give it a try, see what happens. Yeah. One step at a time. What do you use this tractor? Or what are you setting up the uh, monitor for and the GPS? Mostly spreading fertilizer so we can get it good and planting. And if we have to spray with our little sprayer again. Good, good. So Logan's gonna give us an update after two hours of trying to get these globes to talk to the monitor. So what have you found out? Well, I do not have the uh, right cable to plug into the 1500 receiver and I re I'm trying to reprogram the 7000 this one there's another one up top into a uh, lower baud rate so it actually recognizes it on the older display but uh, we'll see <laughs> working on it right now so today is Friday August 16th and as you can tell they're working on the combine again. Still this pulley issue. You got it figured out, Cal? I don't, but Travis does. Yep. Travis is inside. So we've got about not quite 40 acres left to finish harvesting any gusts. And hopefully this is the last time we're messing around with this thing for this cropping season. Yep. You've made a few trips to Ajura and Tichimon. Yeah. Really cloudy, overcast today. Hopefully it'll bring in some rain. We're at uh, 47 days, and in that 47 days, we've had a half inch of rain. So, it's really, really dry. That was a full load. There's white corn drying along the road. speed tables slow people down because there's no law enforcement around for speed enforcement and they work really well <laughs> do you know what kind of wood that is those are huge 